Website security is a really important topic when it comes to developing web applications. And more often than not, it's a topic that store owners try to avoid because of the complexity of the topic, because of the information that is missing usually when it comes to decision making and additional cost that involved into the ensuring that security of your web application is at the right level. And today in this video, I would like to talk about uh, an add-on that is provided by Cloudways hosting provider. And this add-on is called malware protection. There are different ways on how you can protect your website from obvious steps that every store owner has to perform is that first of all, the website has to be updated to the most recent versions of uh, whether it's a platform, a framework, a library uh, of a web application. Because when it comes to, let's say, a Magento platform or a Magento e-commerce website, Magento releases four to six security patches on a regular basis. So basically every year there are like security patches released and it's important to update to the most recent version of a Magento platform. However, there are scenarios where when you update uh, to the latest security patch when it comes to Magento platform and it could happen that some functionality or features can be broken meaning that you have a critical scenario or uh, feature that has to work on your website because of the uh, business complexity of your uh, user scenarios. And unfortunately, it breaks. So the latest version of your website updated to the latest version of a patch uh, provides this additional bug. And what are you going to do in this case? Well, in my experience, what we do and we, what we recommend to our clients is we try to roll back to the most up-to-date version of, uh, of Magento and patches and ensure that functionality works by testing it and providing regression testing. So what it means is, let's say a recent scenario, there was a security patch and the client was uh, sitting on Magento 2.4.6 P5 and there was P8 version of a application. However, there is a newer version of application 247 P3. We updated this client to the 247 P3, like including all security patches. However, we found out that during testing there was an issue with uh, uh, card price rules functionality when you apply multiple rules and unfortunately this functionality is a critical b doesn't work on top of this functionality there was a nasty uh, multi-coupon extension installed and this combination basically didn't work for the client and the solution was Apart from other changes that we did, the solution was to move back to the previous version of a Magento platform, 246P8, and ensure that all those business critical scenarios work as expected. So it's one of the ways on how you can ensure that your uh, web application is fully patched, fully secure. However, there is another part of this uh, security um, question is that it's not only about web applications that you have to ensure that all the versions are up to date like you have to also make sure that your server is up to date when it comes to let's say PHP version so if we're talking about PHP 8.1 it's no longer supported and you have to uh, move to PHP 8.3 and as you may be aware that there is a new version 8.4 that introduces additional features and functionalities and improvements. So it's important to make sure that your libraries, your packages that are installed on the hosting, on the server that support your web application are also up to date. Of course, all this can be automated from one side or another. Let's say if you're running Magento 
and you would like to automate security patches, I think it's it's more a manual work because it requires additional regression testing, manual testing, or better if you have some automated testing installed so you can run your test against the new version and see that your business scenarios work as expected. However, usually it's not the case with automation because automation does, do, does not cover all critical scenarios. Again, from my experience and from my uh, more than 15 years pr uh, practice with uh, Magento applications that by the end of the day, if even if you have automated testing, you have to still perform manual regression testing to ensure that these uh, critical scenarios are successful and they don't have any critical issues that you have to think or uh, revert back to the previous version of uh, your web application. When it comes to cloud hosting updates, this can be automated and usually it's automated and no matter what hosting provider you choose, usually there is an option to enable auto updates of uh, whether it's uh, Unix distributions or some patches in libraries. But again, it has to be tested on a staging environment, pre-production environment, whatever environment you use that is not production because when it comes to production you have to make sure that your production is running like 99.9 percent .9 of the time and that the small change or small update does not introduce additional uh, glitches or bugs in your web application like it happened with our scenario when we updated to the 247 p3 and we have to revert back to 246 because it introduces additional issue it's probably minor in terms of uh, when um, other store owners are experiencing those uh, issues however it was critical for our clients that's why we decided to um, to test it properly and to roll back because the decision was not to uh, introduce these additional issues with the promo quote or card price rules functionality. And when it comes to cloud hosting, I found that Cloudways, that is part of DigitalOcean uh, company, they innovate on a regular basis and one of the new features that they introduced is called malware protection. You can install or enable this malware protection for your Magento store and it's very easy to do. You basically navigate to your uh, Cloudways panel, you go to application security, you select malware protection and inside malware protection there is a page that is responsible for enabling malware protection add-on. This malware protection powered by Immunify 360 and this is a company that sits behind this additional functionality that is introduced and installed for your Cloudways hosting uh, panel and you can easily enable it for your server. So what it means is that it will monitor, you can specify whether you would like to monitor on a, like provide real time scans or you can schedule scans or you can do automatic cleanups, but it monitors your whole web application and ensures that there are no uh, attacks, no malicious code introduced on the application, source code basis and or database level. Malware protection add-on provides the following benefits. Phishing protection, it identifies and blocks phishing attacks in runtime. System protection, protects system from all malicious attacks. Database protection, automatically cleanups infected fields in a database. Malware cleanup, cleanup infected files automatically. Proactive defense, it's block malware injection in runtime. And some other additional uh, robust protection against all cyber attacks. One of the issues with uh, ensuring that your Magento application is up to date, that there are some uh, security holes were found by attackers and they use these holes to introduce some malicious code or data in your, whether it's source code or database in order to get access and write some uh, values into database tables. And one of the problems were that there was a security hole found in Magento previous uh, versions and that security hole allowed to write directly to database table called CMS block and introduce 
a malicious HTML code with the JavaScript that is executed on every page for every CMS block inserted on all pages uh, of a web application. So basically, if your home page consists of, let's say, six uh, CMS blocks, it means that this malicious code will be added, rendered, and executed six times on a home page. And imagine it's a checkout experience where you have also some customizations and you have CMS blocks added and this malicious code is going to be uh, rendered and executed on checkout pages and you can only imagine how painful it could be for your business when a customer will, would find out that some credit card data was stolen if again uh, payment integration is not as secure as it should be. And in this scenario, malware protection can help you. In addition to patching your Magento web application, malware protection add-on can help you to find all these uh, malicious scripts that were added on a database level and or source code level if you're not running your application under Git that is highly recommended to run a Magento application with the Git uh, or store source code files inside the Git and ensure that your web application is fully secure, clean, and if there is any malicious code or something detected, this malware protection will show you on the separate screen and will help you to clean all the mess, source code, malicious code uh, that is found during this regular real-time scans. In order to enable malware protection for your Magento 2 web application, you just simply navigate to application security malware protection page and you click enable protection. Again, depending on number of Magento 2 instances you have on your uh, server, because with Cloudways you can have multiple instances of Magento, you can enable uh, this malware protection for one instance or for all of your instances that are on your uh, current server. You can enable for all servers or for a single server and depending on a number of applications the price will change. So the minimum price is four dollars per application and it's one to five applications and then this price decreases depending on uh, how many applications you are running on your uh, single server. Once malware protection is enabled, you will see uh, an updated page saying that your application is well protected from malware attacks. You will also find a grid with uh, malware detected and if it's all clear, it's fine. Or if something were introduced as part of your uh, web application running on, on production mode, it will show you issues uh, that were found by this malware protection add-on. Also, there is a scan history that shows you what files and database were checked and protective defense events that were occurred during this uh, time of, after which you enabled a malware protection add-on. So in order to perform a first scan, let's go ahead and click start scan. And after just, uh, let's say 10-15 seconds, the scan has been finished and it says that all clear there is no malicious content detected on your application which is good and from now on you can be sure that your application is fully secured with this additional mal malware protection add-on that is provided by Cloudways hosting provider. So make sure to check this malware protection add-on and if you are not part of the um, Cloudways hosting plan make sure to check uh, its pricing because currently it's running on a very great offer you can find details about this offer in the description below this video so make sure to check it and there is also a, an option to have a free migration to Cloudways these guys are providing very professional service so you can migrate in uh, no hassle and enjoy and you can start enjoying this additional security feature that Cloudways introduces on a regular basis. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit like below this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.